makeup lovers today I have a new tutorial for you this tutorial is a interesting combination of two colors that I don't think I've ever put together I don't remember so I've done a lot of tutorials anyhow this is the look so it's a really warm reddish brown purple glitter and some copper inside the inner corner that's also very sparkly and very beautiful Okay, so if you want to see how to get this look done on yourself, keep watching. Okay, here's what I used. The BH Cosmetics 120 palette, second edition. The, these brown colors, I used the first one and this last one. Uh, purple glitter, this one is from MAC. But you can use any glitter you have, of course and stay glitter fix from the body needs to make that glitter stay down and not fall off <laughs> okay all these brushes okay you only really need one blending brush but I used two blending brushes because I used one to apply color and the other one just to blend out and this beautiful pigment from the body needs called uh, sparkles copper check that out how gorgeous is that and this other pigment from the body needs called nude it's just a matte nude shade I also used tiny death from Kat Von D's monarch palette and a pencil eyeliner from wet n wild of course you'll need mascara and primer so on a primed eye start by blending out the nude shade which will be your base color for all the other colors. This is just a good transition color, I want to say. And yeah, apply it all over the lid, a little bit underneath. Okay, now I'm starting to apply the lighter reddish brown. And just tapping it on, you're packing it on the center part of your eyelid. And pack, pack, pack before you blend your first pack and a little bit more and now now we blend it out <laughs> so yeah just blend it and soften it all around the edges I apply a little bit more to intensify that color you want a really rich brown now I'm applying the darker reddish brown with a smaller with a crease brush and I'm starting on the outer corner and working the way in, working my way in and sort of blending it at the same time you know you just kind of applying that color now with the other blending brush I'm just softening all that all those colors together or softening all those colors <laughs> next I apply tiny death with a fluffy brush for that brow bone. Okay, now I'm blending Tiny Death with the nude on the edge. And applying brown on the bottom as well, the darker brown. With a really small detail brush. And back to blending. Blending is essential as always. Now I'm applying Sparkles Copper with a tiny detail brush, just tapping it in the inner corners. Okay, next we are lining with a pencil liner, the waterline, and underneath the eye as well. So on your lower lash line, and tight lining, which is not comfortable. <laughs> I always say that, but yeah, that's what you do. Okay, eyeliner. We're doing a nice thick wing for this look. A little more of a dramatic wing. And triangular shape and then you fill in that little triangle. And just slightly tap on the inner part and work your way out. Okay, so now I'm applying the Stay Glitter Fix lightly with an angled eyeliner brush. So you're just going to tap it right above that liquid eyeliner. 
to create another line which is where we are going to apply that glitter so just lightly tap it on no rubbing but tapping okay now we're applying the glitter and we're tapping again dip into the glitter just a tiny bit and little by little you add the glitter so you just gently tapping on that glitter and that is how you create a glitter eyeliner look <laughs> if you have any fallout get some powder a powder brush and sweep that glitter off your cheeks in an upward motion okay now I'm blending underneath you gotta make sure you blend the brown and the black and I'm going back with the copper just applying a little bit more after the eyeliner and of course mascara you can apply falsies if you want or you can just apply mascara like I did on the top and bottom lashes your look is done yeah all right guys that is it I hope you enjoyed this tutorial I hope that you like this look try it on yourself see what you think you can always wash it off <laughs> yeah anyhow if you like this tutorial remember to give it the thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already part of the makeup artist me makeup lovers until next time rock on people <laughs>